Hi everyone, my name is Akshay. Now, a lot of people who come to me, they have a lot of confusion in mind as to what type of cardiovascular exercise should they do, how much should be the intensity, whether walking, just plain walking will give them any benefit, if low and moderate intensity workouts will help them, or it should always be high intensity workout. Even if they have to do a particular type of workout, what should they eat before and after a workout? How to enhance fat burn? All these questions are actually having a lot of problems or creating a lot of problems in the minds of people. Now let me tell you a very very easy and a simple way to actually enhance your fat burn by the use of simple concept like walking. When you get up in the morning, you're almost deprived of carbohydrates. Say you have your dinner at 8.30 or 9 in the night, which most of the people have. So by the time you get up at let's say 6 or 7 in the morning, you're almost empty stomach. Your body is deprived of the carbohydrates because you've already used the carbohydrates through your night when you're sleeping. Always remember one thing, that during a low intensity workout or a low intensity exercise, now that can be right from normal walking to sleeping or any other low intensity work, your body does not use carbohydrates as fuel. The primary source of fuel during the time when you're, especially when you're sleeping or when you're going for a walk is pure and pure stored fat. But the problem comes is when people really don't know how to use this particular aspect in enhancing the fat burn. In a very, very easy manner, what all of you can do it, the uh, moment you get up in the morning or the first time you get up in the morning, a lot of dietitian and nutritionists tell you to have a fruit. You really do not need a fruit in the morning. Yes, your body is deprived of carbohydrates, but, but that does not mean you need carbohydrates as a fuel source first thing in the morning. In fact, you should be taking advantage of this carbohydrate deprived state of your body which most of the top physique and uh, physique uh, athletes and bodybuilders have been doing since decades and getting that ribbed and muscular physique with a big size. Now this can be done by both men and women or people of any age, not specifically by children. They do not require such a modality. Get up in the morning, have a lot of water. This will help you in clearing your body. Once you've cleared your course, come out. What you need to do is enhance the fat burn. So ideally you should be going for a walk for 40 to 45 minutes only. Do not enhance your time in that particular uh, workout. But to further enhance the fat burn, what you should be doing is you should be eating those things which will help you increase your metabolism. So the first thing you can have is maybe a green tea or a black tea or black coffee. You add some amount of lemon or take 500 mg of vitamin C with it. It will increase your fat burn further by increasing your metabolism. Now, you do not really need to have any form of carbohydrates. Please do not eat any fruit or any biscuits or anything. Your body is deprived of carbohydrates since the last night. Let it be in that state. Having black coffee and vitamin C will help you further increase your metabolism. The vitamin C will act as an antioxidant and the best part is that whether it is green tea or it's black coffee or it is uh, black tea or it is vitamin C, they all have very very high amount of antioxidants and antioxidants are best absorbed on an empty stomach. So you're doing two benefits to yourself, that is you are giving your body a good amount of antioxidant dose in the morning which will be absorbed beautifully and on the other hand you're enhancing your fat burn and increasing your metabolism by having green tea, black tea or black coffee. Now once you have them, just go out and just go for a normal brisk walk. Now when I go uh, talk about a brisk walk, the pace has to be slightly fast. I'm not talking about a sprint or something. It may be a light jog or a fast brisk walk so that you should be uh, not totally out of breath but slightly in a panting uh, state. Don't go overboard. Don't go more than 45 minutes. This will target the focus from fat burn to your muscle burn. So you have to preserve your muscle mass. Now, for a normal person, this will be all he or she will be needing. When it comes to a sportsman, let's say for a bodybuilder or for a physique athlete or for a model or an actor for a particular role, what they should be doing is that apart from having a black coffee, a green tea or a black tea with lemon or vitamin C, they can have a spoon of amino acids. Now, these amino acids will help you preserve your muscle mass further. And of course, your body is empty. These amino acids will be absorbed in a very, very good manner. This simple concept can be used in the morning first thing. A lot of people have a question that I have a very very uh, different schedule, I generally work for uh, long hours in the night so I'm not able to get up in the morning. That doesn't matter. What matters is that whenever you're sleeping, even if you're sleeping let's say at 3 o'clock at night, you get up at let's say 10 o'clock in the morning, your body is still in that particular state. It's still deprived of carbohydrates besides you're not hogging on late night carbs, you're not binging on carbs in late night. 
So if your body is deprived of carbohydrates, you get up in the morning anytime, just follow the same modality. Even if you are not able to follow this particular modality, what you can do is, in the evening, let's say you have your lunch in the afternoon at 1.30 or 2, in the evening by around 5, 5.30, you will be almost empty summer. That time, do the same thing. Have vitamin C or lemon with black tea, black coffee or green tea. Have some amount of amino acids if you want to, if you are a fizzy uh, athlete or you are a sportsman. For a normal person, just the three with lemon and uh, vitamin C. And again, go for a brisk walk or a light jog. For more on fitness, log on to onlymyhealth.com.